adding an archive project action to your workflow is a simple yet powerful way to keep your projects page organized. Here are two examples of how you might incorporate archiving the project into your workflow. In this example, the workflow is set to send a happy anniversary email out one year after the project end date. However, if we archive the project too soon, the anniversary email would never send. Archiving a project will mark any workflows complete and prevent further actions from running, so it's important to add the archive project action at the very end of your process. You can trigger this action zero days after all previous actions complete to archive the project immediately after everything else is finished running. Or you can add a delay based on your personal preference. You may want to create a project status called past and have the workflow automatically move projects there as a holding area, especially if there is a long wait before the final action in the workflow. That way the workflow on the project will still be active, but the past projects will be separated from current projects. You can also use an archive project action earlier in your process to help you manage leads who disappear. Let's say you send out a more in-depth intake questionnaire after a potential client fills out your lead capture. You can add an action underneath to automatically archive the project if the intake questionnaire is not submitted within 10 days. By archiving the project, you're ensuring that no other automated steps will occur. You can always unarchive an archived project manually, so if the client does come back and decides to fill out the form later on, you will still be notified and able to start their workflow again. Tip number one. You can add an expiration date to a form if you want to prevent someone from disappearing and then filling out the form later on. Check out our resources for more information on using form expiration dates. Tip number two. After form is not completed is the only negative logic trigger available. If you want to archive the project after the client did not reply to an email or did not book an appointment, you will need to create a to-do to manually check in and archive the project if needed.